you're a beginner in the gym, you either discover on social media about this new magical habit or your friends tell you about it, about the gym, about exercising, and you're just so fired up about it. You cannot wait. So you spend several nights before that get, getting that gym membership imagining about those bulging biceps, those wing-like lats, those voluminous veins and those rock-hard abs. You're just so excited. So you do enter the gym and then you have a few spontaneous full body sessions, which is okay because people, beginners, do need to find out what works well for themselves, what, what they enjoy. And then, so they try a few sessions out and after a few weeks or months, they, they enjoy it. But then they check in the mirror and they see no progress. This can be disheartening because physical progress is not there, right? This can be super demotivating and you might fall back into your bad habits. You, you might even create new bad habits, which, can, which is not good, it's terrible. So I'm gonna tell you what is really important for the gym. And an extremely important asset, especially when you're a beginner, and you can start this whenever, if you're an advanced gym goer, that is keeping a gym journal, a simple gym journal, right? All you need is a book and a pencil, or if you really don't wanna mess about with this, you can do it on your phone, but we know there's loads of distractions, like stupid distractions on your phone. So, this gym journal, why is it so important? You might ask, why do I need this? This, this silly book to write down all these notes. Why, what can I even write down, you may ask? Well, I'm gonna tell you what you can write down, and that is every single move you do in the gym. That goes from every the date you do your session, the type of session you're doing, every single weight you're doing, including the exercise, of course, and the number of sets and the exactly the exact number of reps you're doing. This is really this is really detailed, and you might you might be wondering what is the point in this. Well, it is so important because you know why the number one thing is accountability. Accountability. That's right. Accountability is so powerful. If you don't know this yet, you're in for a ride because you better start being accountable. When you become accountable, you start to, you start to tell, you can easily tell if, if you're being consistent with some things, if, what, what you're feeling like, what you're doing well, what you, what you may not be doing well, so you can fix upon those things. And when you're accountable, you can also tell if you're really pushing yourself in the gym. So the real point of this is so that you can see what you're doing. And then the next time you do that same session, if it's push-pull legs and you're going in to do push again, you're going to go look at that previous push session. You're going to see, all right, I did this exercise for this number of reps. You're going to go do that same exercise, possibly a different one. If you do that same one, you're going to go for a either greater weight or you're going to go for a greater number of reps. Simple. All right. And that is literally how strength is made. Just pushing yourself, progressive overload. Now those physical gains may not be able to be seen straight away. No, it takes months, if not years, to see physical gains. Because it's just, it's a work of art pretty much, right? But what you will see is strength gains. Generally, across most people, strength gains are, can be easily seen, not seen really, but felt almost, across most people. So... It's, a, it's, gonna, it's an amazing way to track your progress, to keep you motivated, to keep going, to keep your, your hopes up, pretty much. So I'm going to tell you a little example about my progress, okay? So I started this recently, and it's, oh, it's fantastic. I love it. All right, so I'm going to go to a push sesh that I did, all right? So let's go. 26th of April, 2020 to 2020, 2022. That's right. All right, triceps, push sesh and triceps. I did, let's do rope pull downs, all right? I did 10 kg first set, 15 reps. Then the next set, I did 15 kg. After that, 15 kg for 12 reps too. After that, 20 kg for 12 reps, 12 reps for another set and a third set, 
the 14 reps okay and that's just one exercise now we go i think a week later 2nd of may 2022 i'm gonna go back to the same exercise the exact same exercise rope pull downs that's it push downs whatever you want to call it 20 kg times 12 four sets i think look at that four sets i improved and that is what it takes plus extra negatives and four strips if you don't know about those you'll find about them find out about those type of reps in the future on this channel but yeah just like that improvement because i saw i was doing the reps and i saw i knew uh, from before oh yeah i can do this so i've got this high morale i'm gonna i'm gonna tell myself yeah i can do this i can smash this out so i do smash it out and then it might be a bit sore but i did it i beat my previous record and that's what it's all about okay that is what it's all about in the gym it's about progressive overload and if you're a beginner this is going to be really helpful because if you're a beginner you might be not as disciplined as an advanced person so it might be harder for you to stay consistent so this gym journal is going to be so crucial pardon me to staying consistent okay do you understand consistency because after all consistency is so key when you're when you're trying to achieve a goal without consistency you you're done. You're pretty. You're literally done. All right. Understand. You're done. You no. Know, every person who's achieved something, they've been consistent. They've probably been more consistent than anyone else ever knows. So, when you're leaving this video, you must be getting this gym journal. It's so helpful. Right. Just track everything. It's gonna keep you on track. You can be able to tell. Oh yeah, I need to do this. I need to go hard. I need to do this. This number of reps plus one, two, three, however, however many you want, however how much you want to push yourself, you're just gonna smash it. Okay. So just remember, adapt. No, <laughs> accept, adapt, and overcome. All right. Let's go.